When you walk through the doors of the ER, the case you don't want to see every single day is a baby that's, um, you know, dead or dying. You do not. Lifelike robots are now helping doctors save lives. The robots are in San Diego for the world's largest gathering of emergency doctors. It looks so real. Uh, as our tenders reporter Amanda Brandeis explains, one of the newest robotic patients helps them better react when a baby's heart stops. When minutes are all a doctor has to save your newborn baby, you want to know they have the best training possible. There's a ton of um, emotions that go into a, like, a really stressful case like that. It's a situation young doctors like Brandon Guyberson hope will never come through their emergency room doors, but could at any moment. And so what these simulation cases do is allow us to get almost as real as it gets, experience those emotions so that we can know how to handle it when the real thing happens. That's where Super Tori comes in, the world's most advanced baby simulator, the realest thing doctors will practice on aside from an actual patient. The objective of these simulators is to help our doctors in those critical situations. The first time they see a baby in respiratory distress isn't when she comes into the emergency department. Created by Gomard Scientific, Tori breathes, moves, cries, blinks, and has a heartbeat. She's the first baby simulator that can go into cardiac arrest and be revived. Well, her face is going to get a little blue. Older simulators were more similar to the mannequins you'd see at a mall. With Tori, doctors and nurses can practice life-saving techniques on something much more lifelike without hurting a real baby. Once this baby goes into respiratory distress, it's only minutes that they have to treat her. With advances like Tori, the hope is more babies will make it through those critical minutes and on to a long, happy life. Amanda Brandeis, 10 News. And those doctors and nurses are so good at what they do already. This will just make them better. Oh my goodness, yeah. We definitely need people like that. Well, Tori is about a year and a half old and is already being used at Rady Children's Hospital. Mm.